so welcome back so we left off on the other video on cutting her out so i'm just gonna go ahead and cut her out and you guys aren't gonna watch this part because i'm gonna do it off camera so here she is all cut out she looks a lot better not so scraggly or anything i'm just gonna turn that light off yeah she looks a whole lot better than what she did on here so next i am actually going to take one of my gemstones i have here i'm going to stick it on our little teeny tiny bow and i think that's the only place i want to do it at so yeah so let's see i'll get this open and i will do that so i actually have one of the medium sized ones i'm going to put it right on the center of our bow i'm going to take some elmer's glue just add a double bow to the center because I do not want this coming off her at all. Because I have actually stuck one of these to one of my other ones and it came off. So I'm adding some extra durability to it. Which I think it looks super cute. Now I'm going to take some of the smaller ones I have decided. And I'm going to put some. I'm going to put one right by her eyes so it's not just like the focal points on her forehead. So I got one of the small ones, I'm going to simply put one little dot by her eyes, and I'm just going to apply, oops, apply one right next to her eyes, because I think they're super cute. <laughs> ah, these are so weird, I do not like how they put them in that package, but, oh well. They work. I'm gonna put one by this eye. So, that's what she looks like. I think she looks cute. She looks like she's too happy and she's crying. I love that look. So, um, next we are going to scoop the stuff back in here so I don't fall. And then we're gonna take our card. Excuse me, unicorn. And we're going to lighter so while she dries i have decided i wanted to make many little donuts for the inside of the card so i'm actually going to take let's see my acrylic paint bottle and trace some circles circle Another circle. It's a horrible circle. Ah! There we go. <laughs> and I'm going to make these into little teeny tiny um, little unicorns too. But I don't... But they're not going to be as detailed as the front one. So I have just applied the whole and the horn and I'm just gonna show you how I done the horn. It's really simple. Just like that and I'm gonna erase the line. So I was thinking of doing a little um ray mode sprinkle donut on here. So I'm actually gonna probably use my Crayola for this one. It'd be easier because I don't have to do the water and think it'd be super simple so we are going to add the um i want to keep that there i'm going to add the little ears here i guess you would call these the baby the baby ones little baby unicorn donuts not exactly full grown donuts they're just little triangle ears. And with these ones, I want to actually give them a tail. Just like so. And this one's tail is going to be a 
that one's going to be like that. So they're pretty simple, I think. And I'm just going to do their little tiny eyes here. Like that. Just a little eye. And a little eye. Um, I should have probably put that one lower. So I'm going to lower their eyes. Mm -hmm. Oops. They're pretty good. And then I'm gonna make those little mouths. Just like so. And then the rest I'm just gonna color with the um, Crayola. And I think that's all I'm going to do is like put little details on them. So I'm going to find the right colors and then I will show you what I am going to do. Woohoo! So I'm going to be using a peach and a brown for this guy here. He's going to be pretty simple. going to be like a vanilla unicorn donut with some chocolate syrup on him. Yes, this one's a boy. I've made a boy donut unicorn. Woohoo! <laughs> At least I'm amused. Probably annoying you guys because I talk so much, I guess. That's what I assume. Uh, so we're going to go on to coloring his whole body, you can't really see it on camera, I don't think, at least to me, I can't see it, so, but I can see it off camera, it looks like a skin tone, uh, kind of match it, I'm a little darker, I'm gonna say, I'm a redhead, and I'm darker than peach, that's a, uh, I don't think they make their peach too peachy. Have you ever looked at a peach? I don't think it looks like a peach collar to me. So, after you do that, I'm going to take my brown, go around everything. And yes, I'm not using my pen this time. I'm actually using a brown pencil. So I want them to look like donuts, but I don't want them to have that harsh line around them. I'm going to make their ears a little chocolatey up here. I'm just going to put chocolate, drizzling, on here, yeah, here, chocolate drizzling all over the top of his head. While I finish him up, um, I'll let you guys see him whenever he's done. Here's what he looks like so far. I'm going to add, he's going to be like all chocolate flavors. So, yeah, I'm adding chocolate colors to him now. And honestly, I think he's adorable. So far, this is what it looks like. So this is what he looks like. I actually took my white and done his tail and I mixed the colors and put the white. Bigger than that. And I'm actually, yes, I'm going to take my pin and do his eyes in black and his mouth. So they stand out. So here's what he looks like. And yes, he has a giant black hole. 
So next on to its sibling. So with him, I want to do a strawberry chocolate. So I'll show you guys that after I'm done. So here's what it looks like after I got that done. I'm going to take my red now and do the rest. I'm taking my peach color again. Oh, and I'm going to do the um, tail along with the muzzle and peach. Since it's going to be chocolate. Here's what they look like once I took a toothpick and my white creole or acrylic my bad acrylic paint so there we go i'm gonna cut them out i'm gonna put them on the card so i'm taking my glue and i'm going to simply add the unicorn on to the page here she is on the front now we're gonna do the inside and here's the inside i just done that so in another video i will show you guys what the card looks like whenever i decorate it with the words and everything so Leave a like and a comment. I will see you guys next time. Bye.